All right, so he will go on and play Rin in Losers Finals. Here we have our top three. Machu is at least going to be second place, um, sitting in winner's side of Grants right now. And then. What's up, gamers? Mike's in the way. Move the mic. Can't even see me. Mysterious man behind the mic. Uh, yeah, we're going to go to uh, Losers Finals. Yeah. Um, you know, we should probably do a quick shout out to our sponsor for the amateur bracket, if possible. Yeah, let's do it. Who are they? Uh, Who's our sponsor? Your mom. Uh, I've all. Oh, actually, no. no. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't say that. <laughs> you know I didn't mean that. <laughs> that was quite funny, Brady. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Uh, Pepper it's Esports. Pepper. I am, Thank you I am, to I am Pepper sorry. Esports. <laughs> Yikes. Why'd you hide my face? Well, I think you deserve to be hidden yeah. for making that joke. Just, that. Yikes. For all those in the... <laughs> Alrighty, uh, thank you so much to Pepper Esports again. Uh, thank you, Pepper Esports, for yeah, they, our amateur bracket. Yeah, they helped us out yesterday as well at Limerick Dome, so they're just uh, an awesome group. We appreciate having support at our little grassroots scene here on Vancouver Island. And here we go. It's Rin going to be rocking the Aegis here to start okay, this loser's okay. final. Yeah. Uh, we have the Pyra Mithra. Uh, we're playing mostly Sephiroth this tournament, but... Uh, I don't play either of those characters, so maybe this is a better matchup. Oops. Oh, and we want... There, there we, we go! go. Okay. <laughs> now you can see who's who. You know, it's interesting to note here, Kuro is going headphoneless today. Like, yeah, he has them around his, around his neck, neck, but he's not... He's not he wants the crowd power up, I guess. You know, where you are playing here in Victoria, solemn from out of town. Ren, the hometown boy, maybe he's gonna expect that crowd pop off, but we will see. Ren is off the grid. Unknowable. Oh, the spot dodge threw all the hits of that up smash. It's yeah. wild. I guess you maybe only need to spot dodge the scoop hit. Ren goes off looking for that up air there. Okay, the forward air sending him off stage. Goes for the down air. Uh, would have killed, but uh, doesn't hit. Both of them keeping uh, keeping their distance here. They have their each have their own Pokemon Stadium 2 platform. It's a little shelter on the stage. That's where they're most yeah. comfy, cozy. Oh, yeah. Again, yeah. Kuro's really expecting Solemn to go for those oh. high recoveries, and that time the Nair's gonna Killing pick him off. 147. Okay. Good uh -huh. dash attack. Only 85 here on Kuro. He did a fantastic job on that first stock. Ooh, yeah, call out that whip grab. Yeah. The Mithra Actually forward smash so quick. That was yeah. practically frame five. <laughs> Brady coming in to chat about Crystal Pepsi while we're in the middle of casting a set. <laughs> Come on, this is Loser's Finals. <laughs> <laughs> we are not in losers finals. We are bad. <laughs> These two are good. <laughs> okay. Still, Kuro here, over two minutes into the game, hanging on to his first stock. 129 here, a lot from Pali will kill most of the aerials at this point. Okay. Oh! Down there. Oh, he tried to go for the delayed Yoinky Splanky there. Yoinky. Splanky. Yoinky dash Splanky. Get it? Because it's like dash, like a, a like a like an M dash, and okay. then it's also like and dash also forward. Da yeah, okay. okay. I'm huge. <laughs> okay, three, uh, two stock lead from uh, Kuro still uh, on his first stock while Solomon now on his last one. Of course, uh, a couple of matches ago when we saw Kuro playing his game one, he got up three stocks to one against Furies and then lost that game one here. So he's got to make sure he's staying composed, calm, cool, and collected here, going up against the Palo Master from the North Island. Yeah. Okay. Good dash attack though. There. You know, the island has such an eclectic mix of characters and character mains, and yet we've really ended up in a top three with Aegis, Palu, and Rob. <laughs> After all that. You know, the you know, tier lists do matter. They do. Ooh. Yeah, got the upward scoop hit. Oh, jeez. No, not, not going to catch him. Grabs him. Shields the down smash. Uh, grabs him out and throws him off stage. 
Stalem, uh, only one stock behind uh, in uh, percent tier. Okay, yeah, Solom just kind of using aggressive jumps, pushing Kuro into the ledge there. And here we go, it's now one stock apiece. Do not get cheesed, Kuro. We've had it happen before, just a solid dash attack there to push Palo off stage, but here come the nair, Nairs. Nair, Nair, up air, up air. And with Rage, it's 47. Oh. You can't punish that though. <laughs> it's, yeah. At I least mean, laterally. You can punish it from above, but if you get caught shielding it, then it's gotta let her happen. Oh, I love that aggressive return to the stage there. Goes for another up air here. Okay, but the Nair is gonna kill. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Kuro takes game one here. The slight pause that we had was we weren't sure if the kill sparks actually rung true. Yeah. Dang it, Nintendo, account for DI. DC? Shout out to Diet Coke. Shout out to Diet Coke. Uh, Powering up our gamers. The the only reason Kuro won game one. <laughs> Skill? No. Yeah, we got Coke versus Pepsi going on here. Uh, shout out to Crystal Pepsi. <laughs> Yo, yeah, shout out to Crystal Meth. <laughs> <laughs> Top 10 embarrassing moments on commentary? Alrighty. Okay. PS2 again! They make the best games. Okay, okay. There, Brady there. just asked Jared if he was out, and I was like, we're in losers finals, but I forgot there was an amateur bracket. <laughs> <laughs> and waiting in grand finals, Master Nick on the run of his life. We love you, Jared. He does a lot of good stuff on the scene. He's always around. Can we start a chat poll? I I don't know how. Uh, just just type in chat. Just type in chat how many points you want to get. <laughs> I don't know, homies. Okay, good dash tag from Solomon. Yeah, so I'm making good use of Palutena's back. Uh, yeah, it, I, I don't know. It, his his movement just seems so aggressive, right? Uh, Who, Sol Solomon's movement. Yeah, he. It seems like he could just hit you at any moment. Yeah, I, I, understandable with Pally. You got that disjointed staff. You can just scoop people up and then take them for a wild, wild ride. But yeah, he's. Sabbath, how's it going? Sabbath. Just gonna hop over one another here. Game's a leapfrog. Okay, Game. ooh, uh, good overshoot in there. there. Oh, <laughs> oh, man. From the top rope! <laughs> <laughs> Solomon Air dodges through the blaze again. Uh, holding on to this stock. Yeah. There, there. Up air, up air. Blazing in. It's like Battle of BC all over again. <laughs> Speed! Buster! <laughs> smash! <laughs> I show that video to everyone. I showed that video to my dad. <laughs> God bless Shutan for taking a video of it. He can't really hear it on the actual stream. Oh! You're gonna dash underneath the auto reticle. Excellent dash back. Yeah. It does low profile you a little bit. She yeah, kinda, she kinda, it's pretty low. She slithers Limbo's down towards bit. the ground. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like a forward limbo. <laughs> yeah. All right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Catching the high recovery. With you the gotta get down. Yeah, Solomon does have a jump. Okay. Finally touches the ground, only to get back air. Yeah. This is not very fun for the Palo player here. Okay. Finally able to get some solid footing. Oh, she's got. Was he able to get an up tilt out there, even with the parry in between the hits of the jab? That's quite impressive. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Catches the jump in. Oh, LMAO, Nightbot is sending people the Kovacon bracket in chat. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunate. <laughs> Sorry. We'll fix that for next time. 
ne next time we'll have the Phoenix series bracket. Yeah. Uh, next stitch face, you'll. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it'll always be one delayed. <laughs> oh, and Kuro oh, is dead, not, yeah. Not making it back. Okay. That wasn't all that momentous of an occasion, it felt like, but. Oh, yeah, yep, going on. Yeah. Uh, I mean. Kuro SD'd two of those stocks. I mean, with, with the up B, the first stock, and then the side B, that last stock. Uh, house tour, house tour, house tour, house preview. Oh, it might not be on. It's an unlocked song, so. Oh, there it is. House preview. House, pre house preview. Okay, God, no, damn okay. it. <laughs> You're not the one in the losers final. I time. definitely am not. I can play house preview next time. Oh, switching, switching colors. Switching colors. Yeah. Very important. The classic. Three, two, oh, KK Condor. Okay. One, this oh yeah, because yeah, when you're on a Saturday night and you pick. KK, uh, Bubblegum KK, it picks a random KK song. Does it? Yeah. Oh. I didn't know that. Yeah. Can you just not listen to K K Bubblegum KK on Saturday? Uh, yeah. And I don't think you can listen to, like, these songs at any other time. I don't even think they're in, like, the uh, like the music what? menu. No way. Yeah, they're hidden songs. I think it's kind of fun. I didn't know that was a thing. That's cool. Yeah. Also, I can't believe we're talking over the KK con. Okay, he's gone now. We can talk. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> Bro, did you really just talk during the KK concert? <laughs> talk during KK set? Uh, speaking of sets, uh, <laughs> game three. Bro! <laughs> Lowest hanging fruit on the ground <laughs> in the dirt. God damn. Oh, is that going to kill? Not quite. Okay. Oh, yeah. Up airs through the, the charging. The Blazing end. Yo, I kind of bop with this song. KK always puts up bangers. Yeah. Never, literally never misses. Such a versatile artist. It's true. I mean, his just mastery of every single genre. Oh, that's going to kill. Ooh. Yeah, okay. Yeah. All right, finally, first blood drawn in this pivotal game number three. Get counter pick advantage moving forward if you're able to take this one. Always important. Mm -hmm. Oh, Perry's the last hit. Down smash. Yeah. I'm just gonna uh, spread some gospel here. Machu just said in the crowd, he's calling it Panda Ouch. Panda Ouch? He thinks that Panda's gonna sponsor him. Okay, that would that would be sick. That'd that be would so be super cool. cool. Yeah. Can't wait to, to watch the YouTube channel Ouch debating Esam. Yeah, that's the thing. Is like he's not really much of a content guy, right? Yeah. I mean, he tweets, like, once a month or something. Yeah. He barely, like... You see his grad quote tweet? God, that was so funny. <laughs> so, so fresh. I love him. So Ice cold. Big. Okay. Alrighty, yeah, uh, this is a solid lead here for Solemn. After yeah. Koro was able to take the first stock. Good dash attack from Koro coming out. Oh, just <laughs> standing there waiting out there. Yo, you, did you buster? just punish Lightning Buster? That's not how that's supposed to work. Oh, almost gets the down tilt there on the... Uh, 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 photon edge. <laughs> uh, 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 <laughs> I panicked. Uh, the 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 Mithra side B. Uh, that's the coward's way out. I'm not gonna call it like that. Oh, oh, goes oh. Splunky, but not a percent. Yeah, well, he was aerial as well, yeah, so he yeah, was able right, to get the tech yeah. roll. Yeah, text the text the Yoinky. <laughs> no Splunky allowed. Splunky prohibited zone. Oh, you're dead to that. All right, back throw here. Do you think if Kuro loses this game, he switches? Maybe. Oh, get up attack through that. Okay. Yeah, it goes for the down air, the classic, yeah. He always goes for the down air two frame. Are you dead? Not quite. Oh, tries to go for the up tilt there to level this one up. Ooh, there. Can we stop being furries in the chat, please? Thank you. Okay. Yeah, Solomon here just, I mean, refu a staunch defender of this final okay. stock. Refuses yeah. to let it go. <laughs> or not his final stock, his second to last stock. Pardon me. No platforms okay, yeah. here. Okay. Finally takes that stock. Nowhere to hide. I miss KK. I wish he'd come back. <laughs> I miss him. <laughs> I miss him every day. When will my husband return from war? 
Remember when my husband returned from his concert? Oh. That, ooh, good dash attack. Uh, oh, <laughs> trying to send him all the way off. Yeah, I don't know if you would have been able to kill him with that, but uh... I mean, if you lightning buster from there, I think you might be able to kill. Yeah. Uh, this is a really good platform layout for Pyramithra, I feel like, that ability to just, you know, get even further off stage, mm. right? And, and not have to worry as much about recovering afterwards, because you just have that platform to give you the added distance. Yeah. Okay, and there, doesn't kill with that the second. The dash attack, such high blast. How do you get so down, Kuro? No platforms! That's a re grab, oh, yeah. <laughs> Solomon gets the down air on there. Two, one. One game away from it, winning his sixth straight set in losers. Holy wow. Wait, is this six or seven? It was five last. Was that? Yeah, it was five last time we checked, so this would be the seventh. This would be his seventh straight set win in losers. Okay, we got the yeah, we got the Sephiroth song, we got yeah. the Sephiroth pick. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Whoops. Dum, 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 dum. I have, I have, I have screwed the pooch. No, but I, I accidentally clicked on Solemn. <laughs> okay. 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 There we go. And this is, I mean. The island did vote Kuro, I believe, as a hero in that Twitter poll that was going around. <laughs> so this is your hero moment, playing the villain. Yeah. <laughs> oh, and try the to villain get... take our hero into back into uh, get the rematch against Machu in Grand Finals. Yeah. Or can Solemn continue this run of a lifetime to number two? Yeah. Potentially number one. Ooh, oh, there's a dash attack. Do not see that coming out too often from Solemn, but understanding that's possible time. Yeah, I think you're a villain, Lucas. Yeah. It's pretty, uh, pretty indisputable. Oh, can't get the dash attack to follow through on the Shadow Flare here. Okay. Forward air, four. Ooh. Nice. Oh, tried to go for the three piece. Oh. <laughs> Three's a crowd, but three is not a kill as it whiffs. Oh, the Ken! Ah, nice <laughs> counter, all right. The jump up, uh, uh all scintilla. Right, yeah. That's what it's called. <laughs> We're so bad <laughs> remembering the names and moves. Well, there's like, how many characters are there? Like 90 or something? True. And they've each got four special moves? True, and some of them have more, like Kazuya and like all the different names that he has for his yeah. like, tsunami kick and Dragon punch and I can't I remember 400 moves, name moves. Yeah, move names. Move names. I, I'm a, I'm out here in the baby registry moving names, baby. <laughs> okay. Ooh, spot on just to grab. Okay, the nair. Ifio, you're very close to getting a ban in chat for talking about minions. Oh, just goes for the weak flare there. Why is everyone a Sephiroth moves a flare? Oh, nice timing there in the neutral get up to get through the explosive flame. That would have killed easily at 163. Okay. Oh, okay. The raw nice dash attack. attack from Solemn. Takes the stop here. And takes a shadow flare as well. Come on, you gotta got see he's doing on. that. Oh, yeah, and he just takes the damage. Okay. I wonder what the NR means in this tech. Uh, no restraint? Maybe. Uh, not for resale. That would be NFR. Well, the, the four is, is like not an important word. True, so. I guess. It doesn't need to be the acronym. I guess. We have ten characters to use. Oh, the four will okay. we'll catch yeah. mid teleport there. Almost a full stock ahead here. Yeah, this Sephiroth pick is working out really, really well for Kuro so far. But if he wins this game, he won't get to choose the music on the next day. That's true. I don't think Solomon will let him like Furies did. Okay, oh, you got the Shadow Flare on you. Okay. Oh, it confirms that the up smash. It's even in percents, but Kuro has one more stock. Okay. Good dash attack, catching uh, those landings. Oh, wow. Jeez, he still got hit by the up smash there? That move lasts that forever. Lasts for so long. Oh, 
doesn't shield the last hit. Dash attack. Oh, okay. okay. Supposed to play. In. Okay, yeah. And Kuro, I mean, he's got an 80% lead here, but if he's not able to come through and win this one, it will be Solom off to Grand Finals. Okay, yeah. Oh, oh nice yeah, catch! Yeah, there. Okay. New <laughs> you do it. Thanks. <laughs> okay, yeah. Good. Good stuff. Game five. Is it DSR or modified DSR? Okay, they have not played on Battlefield this set, so Kuro bans Battle. Where will Solemn go? He's, the, he's pondering. He looks like the thinker over there. Yeah. Get this man a toilet to sit on. And the choice is... Survey says... Small Battlefield. Whoop. What? He's giving him the music. Again, he lets him have the one wing dangle? What are you doing, Solomon? <laughs> this is almost as bad as the uh, the Oinkum's taunt to get bodied. Yeah. Were you there for that? Yeah. Okay, yeah, I couldn't would... remember who was on the mic with me. Alrighty, here we go, folks. Game this five. Is, this is the Advent Children one winged angel. <laughs> Yo, is that a movie? <laughs> Yes, this is Losers Finals. It says it right there in the top bar. Oh. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah, four years and out of the Shadow Player Charge. Ooh, oh, oh, no! He's got five of them. Oh, oh, oh okay, that was... a roll, but uh, yeah. there's, there's too many of them. I mean, he got most of them. Most of them, I feel like that was a pretty solid job using yeah. the alleged invincibility and the roll invincibility. Yeah. Wait, what's Solomon's last name? Could NR just be his initials? True. <laughs> That's also possible, but also lame. I want that. I expect better from these folks. Be creative. Oh, catching with that up air there. It's even at 73% apiece on this first stock. <laughs> he tried to do it again! Yeah. <laughs> Okay, one shadow player here. Yeah, I mean, Kuro has shown he can combo off of any number of them, so this time, though, it will send Solom away from Sephiroth. He doesn't quite have the run speed to jog over there. Okay, the back air. Oh, again! He's shown that hand a couple times in this set. It's so many just short hop arrows coming out from them. Ooh, oh, I thought he caught him for a second, yeah. but he does catch him with the down angle down. forward tilt. Yeah. All right, okay. yeah. advantage Kuro here in this ever pivotal game five. Stock ahead, but at 105, Solomon could seal this off pretty pretty quick with a uh, uh, back air from ledge. Not quite gonna kill. No, just hanging on. And of course the recovery mix-ups that Sephiroth gets at this percent when he has wings. Does he use his triple jump? Does he just recover back? If you get caught by an Octo Slash while you're trying to edge guard, it's 25%, but there the confirm into the up tilt. Not a move that's too often used by Palutena players, but as a kill finisher, it has that ability. 28% lead for Kuro, 46% lead suddenly with the back air. Uh, he wants those Shadow Flares on him. Yeah, I mean, he's just in such a good position when he has them. Uh, yeah, I mean, it forces you as the opponent to just uh, think in your head, okay, how am I not going to get caught by these? Where am I going to go? And if you... Yeah, you only have a few options to not get hit by them. And then if you do, I mean, that's that's damage by itself. But Kuro is so good at converting off of them. That that's that could be your stock if you don't deal with them. Yep. And again, we, uh, we, we see this little ballet that they do in neutral where they just hop back and forth over each other, beside each other, trying to get those short hop. Aerials to connect, they're both very good with their shield discipline, and the frame data is quite similar, so. Solemn suddenly with a bit of a lead. Uh, Kuro now has his one wing. Uh, 
Oh, that just was close. Miss spacing that down smash. Yeah, Solemn felt the, the wind breeze past him on that sword. Yeah. Oh, he re oh, he oh. ran in that time, but he was not close enough to get the grab. I don't yeah. think back throw kills yet. It was a little bit sale because he used it earlier. And oh, the dash attack, attack catches the mix up DI. The Nair, the invincibility from the dash attack, uh, able to take that stock. That's Palu privilege, baby. Yeah. Solemn with a stock lead here. Oh, and just continuing to pile it on here. Okay. <laughs> It's the weak slash back onto stage. Another one. Trying to connect with an up air in the air, but it's a nice drift from Solemn here. Knowing what he needs to do to stay defensive. Hold on and just get this chip damage on Kuro. Yeah, he, he just needs to uh, hold on to this stock for as long as he can, get, get as much as he can off of it, and then, I mean, that's that's just all he needs. It's, it's, uh, Kuro at 88%. Oh, gets around. Oh, goes for the landing down air there with Kuro, pulling out all the stops. I guess down air oh, has to, to be take landing. The stock pretty quickly. <laughs> yeah, trying to get a spike there. Yeah, throwing out everything. We saw forward tilt, forward air, up air, back air. Oh, okay. But Solemn In just there. so resolute. Goes for the grab, but uh, the roll goes too far. The up air is that gonna kill? Yes. It does. <laughs> Solemn takes game five, moving on to oh. grand finals. Uh, oh. Uh, yes. Which are you not quick? Uh, we're just gonna switch out the dock real quick. It's not mine. Wow, what a set.